Hey, it's Sol, and I have a public service announcement for you all. Uh, like the video, subscribe for more content. The actual announcement is that uh, the trading post thing is going to change uh, in like just a little bit. And so we're going to take a look at some of the new items. But of course, double check that you had spent all of your tender for the month, if that's kind of your thing, or to freeze items uh, that you want to save for a later purchase. Now, I haven't looked at these yet. Let's take a look at what we got for the month of April. Uh, the Trading Post vendors have updated their inventory. You'll want to hop to it, oh boy, and add these excellent new items to your collection. Bunny suit. Bunny suit. Visit T and Dub or whoever just outside of the thing. Take a look at your stuff and be impressed. Egg stuff. Okay, uh, well, of course. Egg Bob. I, you know, I don't recall if this was a shop thing or not, uh, but that one's going for 600 tender right on and we got a pink Ooh, it's a very very pink dragon to go for what would have been april but i guess now is a good time too uh, i guess i guess pink sort of goes with that easter spirits kind of sort of maybe uh going for 900 this seems to be the big ticket item that uh would normally be reserved for uh like other mount i guess all mounts are going to go for this particular price nice uh, we have a cape that's going for a hundred. No, oh, dude. Okay, this is. Okay, I'm getting this. <laughs> this is cool. I mean, it's a cool looking high res cape. Wonderful. Uh, goes for a low price at only a hundred tender. But this is unique, right? This is unique, and depending on how you randomize it or how you how you spin it, can look really cool or really creepy at the same time. Yeah. This is like going to be a kind of a must buy for me. This one, not so much. Maybe the mount, you know, for people who are big mount collectors, absolutely same thing goes for pet collectors. And this thing's kind of cute. But y'all know me. My my habits tend to go for like the weird and the unique. And this is unique. Please have more wild stuff. Uh, we have two kinds of torches. A little disappointing that we're seeing two of the same kinds of items, but I think we've seen that in the first month. We had like those bandoliers or something like that, that hunters had. Uh, in this case, we're getting uh, two offhands, which is, mm, you know, I prefer to have something that, uh, I guess, shaman can dual wield it or something like that, but uh, paladins not so much unless they are holy. We have classic sword. Classic uh, classic high res sword, also going for a hundred. Lot of cheap items. Uh, I, I, I think, I guess this list will get, get more expensive as we go down. And then we have these honking fists. These are huge. This is what we get for seeing it on an orc. It'll probably look just as ridiculous on anyone else, but definitely on here. And unfortunately, we don't have you know full models to look at. Uh, it is definitely honking big. Buck seventy five on that one. We have like a expedition kind of hat Ooh, okay i like this one i'm not sure about the color the color is a little bit uh well it's a little bit red obviously uh but this one i kind of like i think this, this is pretty cool except for people who have their ears or horns or whatever sticking right through it but that's all right uh the crimson nexus crescent is a two-handed axe going for 225 tender very very different what can I say? Or, you know, I would say, like, at least uh, sitting on this model orc, it's very bold. It's very bright. I wonder if it shines or anything like that. That could be kind of cool. Uh, and we got books. We got more offhand stuff. Not too pleased. <laughs> Not super pleased about that, actually. I mean, we got these two offhands. There's, like, these these torches or whatever that are back here. I hope these things have, like, cool animations and, and lighting effects on them. I doubt that these... Uh, paladin looking books would have the same thing but you know it's cool that that uh, that they're showing up but yeah going for 225 for these uh, as opposed to the 100 for the torches seems like a weird way to measure the value there uh, and then we have another maze uh, this one clearly animated but probably doesn't have like you know I mean it doesn't look like a flail but going at 450 that's not so bad um, and we've got Trapper's Munitions. Oh, this is neat. So it's a transmog set. I suppose that it's two kinds of things. You could either have either have the quiver or the ammo bag in the back. That's neat. I like that. I think for hunters, this is like fantastic. I think for anybody, this would be like fantastic. It's like, hey, check me out, guys. And then they're like, uh, aren't you a death knight? Whatever. 
I wear what I want. Okay, leave me alone. And that one's going for a cool 500. So that's half your that's half your stuff already, unless you've been saving your tender. Uh, and then uh, we also have for 750 this uh, rune corrupted rune lords regalia. Um, I'm gonna guess that this is a recolor. I'm not too familiar. It features what looks like a belt and wrists and um, a robe. Maybe this is a full robe, uh, shoulders and helmet too. Not my favorite this time. So I'm not quite sure. And I think, uh, well, let's see what the grand prize. Oh, it was the very top thing. Okay, I, I, I saw it, but I didn't see it. So the bonus reward is Blades of Elune. So, two, so, swords? Really? One-handed swords? This is different. This actually kind of breaks my whole theory on, hey, the bonus reward is going to be something that everyone can use. I was under the presumption that it was going to be, you know, something like either a mount or an ensemble set. Although, if it was this ensemble set, then I'd be like, oh, that's not a very great thing to work towards. These are cool. It's just, uh, it's just unfortunate that not everyone's going to be able to really enjoy it or take advantage of it. I mean, yeah, these these two swords look unique. Like, that one has, like, the leafy foresty stuff on it. This one has, I don't know, is that, like, bone kind of? Uh, petrified bone or something? I don't know, something like that. But, yeah, they, they look unique. That's cool and everything, but, you know, like, what if I only play as a priest? What if I only play as X class or whatever that doesn't use two-handed, uh, that doesn't use... Uh, one-handed swords or daggers or whatever these are um, so that's so that's kind of a letdown but it's a nice plus for like everyone else so I guess going forward we can look for we can going forward we can look forward to instances like these where hey you know what it might not necessarily be something that we're going to enjoy on our main character if that's our thing um, but it's an okay lineup um, I would say like like some of the previous months lineups were, were uh, things that I enjoyed a little bit more. I'm surprised that we don't have a cloak, <laughs> that there's not another uh, kind of colored cloak and hood or scarf or whatever to sports because I figured that that was going to be like a very regular thing. I think one of my favorites is going to be like the Trapper's Munitions. The, the This quiver looks really, really good. I, I really like the look on that. Uh, I'm going to want to see that live uh, once it goes up. The helmet feels like kind of a winner for me too. Going at bucks, going for a buck seventy-five. Um, I might pick up that sword just out of principle. <laughs> I mean, it's not super impressive, you know. It's just like a high res basic sword, but it's a pretty cool looking sword. Um, and the gloves. So five hundred for the uh, five hundred for the quiver. Six hundred. This makes six hundred. Uh, this is 775, maybe 875. And if I wanted to go for the cloak, 975. So that might be it for me. I'm curious what you guys are going to be going for. Or are you guys going to try to maybe pass this thing up and save your tender for something, you know, for, for the next month? Uh, let me know your thoughts. And what do you guys think of this month's selection? Of course, if you don't mind, like the video, subscribe for more content, and I'll catch you later. Stay safe. Stay healthy, and as always, stay breezy. Mm -hmm.